is held in place by several structures. One of them is the ovarian ligament. Uh, we also have the mesovarium, there's a broad ligament, um, there are suspensory ligaments, but again, in this model, we can see the ovarian ligament. Uh, there's no real order that these are these structures internally are sort of organized in, so it might be easier if I just move from one side to the other. Uh, we have a graphene follicle after ovulation here. Uh, we have primordial follicles. This is uh, a corpus albicans. You'll see it here and here as well, corpus albicans. This is a secondary follicle, primary follicle. This is a secondary oocyte that's actually being released from the ovary itself. And this would be this graphene follicle at ovulation. So at ovulation, and again, remember this one was after ovulation. And then here we see the corpus luteum. So this is sort of a sectional view of the ovarian cycle.